Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm going to throw together a quick little New Year's Eve look and I got to get out the door so we're going to jump in. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you've been with me, thank you. And if you don't like me or my videos, please don't fucking watch me. I'm Nervous Cup of Tea and I'm super okay with it. Alright, so I did my skincare, which was Charlotte Tilbury products. So I used Glow Toner, her oil, collagen oil, and then I put a little magic cream under my eyes. Um, I used an eye primer, which was Hourglass. That's the only other things that aren't going to be Hourglass is uh, a pen I'm going to use on my eye, but everything else is Hourglass. So these are our Hourglass primers, and I'm going to use the airbrush one. That's the one I've been into lately. It's a newer one that they come out with. And I just use a tiny bit right where I have pores. Alright. And uh, because I'm doing a quick look, uh, I'm going to just use one eyeshadow. And it's going to be a Bobbi Brown. Um, and I think I'm going to go with Moonstone? Hold on, let me look. Sorry. Should have figured this out before I started, huh? I think I'm going with Micah. Let me see. Mm. Nope, I'm going with Moonstone. All right, and I'm going pretty quick because I'm in a hurry. So I'm going to use Bobbi Brown Moonstone on my eyes. Uh, how's everybody been? Hopefully everybody's got plans and plans to stay, stay safe tonight. Um, I am partaking only <laughs> this way. Cheers. Uh, I only a little bit. Um, I don't drink, so that's my little partaking. But my son, uh, his my oldest son, his friends are meeting up at a bar, and my husband would like to go drink a little, and then we're gonna come back and celebrate with baby girl before it turns. To you know, midnight. So, yeah, my husband will be back to get me in just a minute. And we are going to go up there and I'll probably be designated driver like I always am. <laughs> so, this is a very easy one and done shadow. Uh, I love Bobbi Brown cream eyeshadow sticks. They're just one, two, three and done. It barely looks like I have anything on there, but they're beautiful, shiny. And they stay in place so you don't get them all over. They're just beautiful. Yeah, the baby's taking a nap, I'm pretty sure. So we are going to go. The kids, the kids' friends actually asked for <laughs> us, us, me and Mike, to actually be there tonight. So that was kind of cool. That's a good feeling when you get along good with your kids' friends. They're all good people. All right, and that is it. I got some little shimmer, and we're going to call it good on that. And I'm going to take a little bit of mica, which has just the tiniest little hint of color, and do that on my outer. It's like a silvery, taupey kind of, just a little bit, just to give a little depth. Just a tiny little bit. There we go. All right. I love it. And now I am going to try to breeze through <laughs> eyeliner and everything quickly. So I'm going to go in with an hourglass liquid liner. Oh, I'm going to end up being quiet because I'm trying to concentrate because I'm stoned. Alright. Not doing too much. Just a little bit. And I'm going to use this new Hourglass pencil they have. I have the other one. It's not retractable though. Uh, and I guess, yeah, this one is. So we're going to use the new one. 
I don't know if you noticed or not, but that was a Christmas gift my husband got me. And then he put up my black shelves for me. And I have them all decorated, and I'll show you guys. Uh, I just don't have time tonight to do a little tour, but this one whole tall shelf has all my eyeshadow palettes. Uh, I didn't even have room to fit them all on here, and they're covered head to toe. I had to bust into the side, so I will do a little tour of those coming up. I just didn't have time tonight. <clears throat> all right, and then I am going to use... I have both of the Hourglass Mascara's Caution's good, but my favorite is the Unlocked. So I have both, but I like this one the most. So I'm going to use it. It's amazing for your lower lashes. Let's do a quick little coat. Yeah, my eyes just have a really pretty little shimmer, so I'm getting older. A little more ladylike, huh? All right, I'm gonna do lashes real quick. I'm gonna go in with my girl boss from Tarte, and uh, let me go get these on, and I'll be right back. All right, lashes are on, and we are good for the most part. Um, <clears throat> so, how did everybody's Christmas go? I'm excited to hear from everyone in the comments below. Make sure you guys say hi. Um, and I'm just going to keep it trucking. All right. I'm going to go into this as a newer foundation ambient, uh, soft glow by Hourglass and everything else is Hourglass from here on out. I just, I haven't bought in any of their eyeshadows because they're, you can only buy them online. You can't see them ahead of time. It's just kind of weird. So, but I'm going to take that and get this going. I got a mirror behind the camera. So if you see me looking back there, that's why. And... Ooh, that is pasty. Oh, I can only do so much, right? It's pasty, I'm pasty. <laughs> oh, look at that. We'll be able to warm it up with some uh, bronzer, hopefully. This is what uncooked chicken looks like, my friends. And this isn't even the lightest shade. That's the crazy part. This is actually a like a second or a third shade in. Mm. Wow. Oops, I got my earring. Hopefully I don't look back at this video and see how cringy I was and decide not to post it, but I hope everybody has a good night and you guys are safe and made safe plans if you're going out hopefully you had good christmases with your family i did um i didn't hear from my brother i haven't heard from my brother since the day after thanksgiving i had him over and we did like a friendsgiving thing and i got to see him he stayed for a few hours we had a lovely time and i haven't heard from him since i know he got my mom's pit bull back um but he'll probably be living on the streets with my brother so i don't know how to feel about it but it's my brother's dog there's only so much i can do my dog has cancer so i guess i'd rather him be with my brother anyways because that's you know his person so it was my mom and my brother always you know but I'm going to try to blend that in because holy shnikes, look at that. That's insane. So I'm going to try to push some of it in and cover it with some bronzer. And I guess we're going ghostly theme today. I have other foundations from Hourglass, but I didn't want to use anything. I just wanted to use that one just because I've only used it maybe twice. So I wanted to use it by itself. We'll have to think about that next time. I have a whole box over here full of hourglass products, but yeah, that'll be all right. Let's do some coloring before I do any more uh, concealer. I'm going to go in and use this trio. I'm going to do some cream products real quick. Hopefully I can do this in a timely fashion and not stumble through. <laughs> 
I'm going to use a little bit of my Smashbox spray. It's my favorite. It's a primer water. We're going to start going in with some color here. Ooh. There we go. <laughs> oh, hopefully we can save it. Some trickery. That is pale. I had a good Christmas though. I got to be with the baby and see family. This is always the best. Baby got spoiled. She had a great Christmas, of course. Okay. I think I probably will do a tiny bit of cream contouring, but I'm going to do it a little different. I'm going to spray the brush and then get it wet on the back of my hand. And then I'm going to take the cream contour which is just one of the foundation sticks in Espresso. I'm going to put a little bit on there, and I'm just going to use it off of there. I don't feel like going through all the drama of it all, so I'm just going to pick it up and do a little bit of shading. Woo! There we go. I'll do it on this side. here. I have a stick blush and then I have one in the stick, or I have a stick brush blush and a cream blush. Say that 20 times. Wait, that's not the right thing. Hold on. I'm opening the wrong one. <laughs> okay, and this is the blush. Let's see. That's pretty. And then this is like a corally one in this trio. Which I think I'm going to actually use this one. Uh, and save this for another time. Oh, I'm gonna go in with what I know. I'm in a hurry. I gotta get out of here. All right, let's do my little blush. And then I'm gonna blend all this in with a blender. I'm just going to get this put on with a brush. Stipple it all in. Okay. That works for me. Over everything. I'm going to do a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of concealer. This is very potent, so we're just going to do a tiny little bit. That's my little mirror. There she is. Oh, yeah, I have a cream... Uh, Cream highlighter too, I should probably use. Okay, I'm going to get this powder ready. And then I have a cream, con uh, cream highlighter. I keep saying the wrong word. You guys are going to have to... Forgive me on this one. I probably didn't make much sense if I did speak any coherent sentences. <laughs> I think I got stoned as a gravel road. Uh, kind of lost it from there. <laughs> but I will be back after I go see a couple of my kids' friends. I'm going to go meet up with them. I'm not driving, of course. Uh, I'm going to go meet up with them at the bar and then get back home and be with the little baby girl by midnight and yeah 
I'm going to use some Hourglass Loose Powder for my under eyes real quick. Let me get my little brush here and see how bad they crease. Oh yeah, they always do. My makeup always looks a little bit better about an hour or two after I put it on. It all settles in good. <laughs> it's like lived in makeup. I'm just going to go around real quick with this rest of this powder. And then I have a, a powder that's in one of these little... You can buy these little bigger palettes. They got like bronzer, a powder, some blush. This is the Ambient Infinity Powder. And I like to take that with my, uh, what do you call this? My, uh, hmm. Beauty Puff. It's like skin like powder. I love it so much. I'm going to use it to press in. See how beautiful it has a little bit of a glow. It's just stunning. These little palettes are like 80 or 90 bucks, but you get two shades of blush usually, and then you get a powder bronzer and a highlight. And then this time they used a this powder, uh, infinity powder in it. So I think that was a lovely choice, but it's just beautiful. Beautiful little palette there. I got a couple of them actually. This one has, yeah, like a highlighter, a bronzer, two shades of bronzer, a blush. Their other type of powder, they're just beautiful. I don't know if I'm speaking coherent sentences, but you guys got me, right? Yeah, beautiful powder. Okay, let's do some bronzer real quick. I gotta get ready. Take it serious. Set everything down. Some powders now. All right. Oh, I just closed my hand in that. That hurt. Oh, fucker. All right, I got a couple blushes. I think I want. Mm, there's this one, and then there's this one. I think I'm going to go with this one. This is uh, Diffused Heat. Yeah, let's do this. Mm, beautiful. Hourglass makes some of my favorite uh, face products. They're just very flattering on all age groups, all skin types. Obviously, the older the better, so yeah, you're getting older. Hourglass is where it's at. All right, and then I think I'm just going to take, I was going to do shimmer on the bottom, but I think I'm going to take, I did moonstone, so I'm going to do mica on the lower after I do a little bit of eyeliner. i got to get going. I'll spray my face after I do this. All right. There we go, tight line a little bit. It's a dark, dark black. Whew, very, very good eyeliner, I love it. Okay, I'm gonna take mica. Just give it a little bit of definition under my eyes. Ooh. Yeah, pretty. All right, I'm getting there. We're almost ready. And I am going to do a quick spray of Fix Plus. Oh, the baby's up. I can hear. <laughs> and then I'm going to take um, one of the uh, highlighters from this palette. I think I'm going to take the one from here. We're going to do a little highlighter real quick. Let's start with one of these. Whoa, look at that. Jesus. Didn't even mean to go in that hard. <laughs> They're beautiful though. You see that? Wow. Stunning. Alright. Let's do a little bit of that. Okay. And then Hourglass makes a beautiful spray. 
Uh, this is the Veil Soft Focus Setting Spray. I'm going to do that real quick too while we're here. Oh, is that coming out right? Shot at me weird. Hmm. Shake better than I just did. All right, and then I think I'm going to do a little under eye mascara, and I think that's going to be it. I think I'll do a quick lip and let you guys get out of here. It's going to be a quick one. <laughs> I just went for it as fast as I could. Oops, that one's bad. Shit. I have so many of these. One of them is actually really old. I need to throw it away. Do a little bit of this for under eye mascara. Did we finish a sentence at all today? Okay. Bottom mascara is important. I think it completes an eye look. Alright. And then I do have a separate little um, highlighter that I'm going to use for my inner eye and my brow bone. This is from Ofra. It's my favorite. I think it's glazed on it. It's a little silver guy here. Okay. Where were my nose? Oh yeah, they're back. All right. I got to get going. I got a quick little lip here from Hourglass. I don't know what it is. Uh-oh, got some on my teeth. Because of why not? Uh-huh. Alright, so this is my look, guys. Sorry if I mumbled through this. I got super stoned. Um, but Happy New Year with my tacky little hat. Happy New Year. I love you guys. I hope you're safe. And I'll be back on here soon. I just got my recording area. I have room and now. It's all great. So I'll be back soon to do videos. I love you guys. Happy New Year. Be safe. Peace.